Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of EverQuest Old School. And on tonight's episode, I am joined by uh, two very good friends of mine. You may recognize both of them. Uh, we have uh, Hydros Inc. with us. Thoom, the Barbarian! And we also have uh, Dark Dragon with us tonight. I are deuce. Now, <laughs> we do have some other people in the group with us. They're not in the Skype call. We have uh, Chupacabra who is a really good friend of ours. Uh, he's been giving us stuff all night long. Uh, he's, yeah. yeah, Savak. He gave uh, Dark Dragon a nice uh, robe. You guys want to... Maybe you can link that uh, to me real quick, well, and I'll show the... He, he wasn't able to give the robe because it kept saying that I have a duplicate, but he did oh, hook me up right. with this. Mm -hmm. So oh, you already right. had one. It's saying that I. it's a duplicate. So he, I'm gonna check my bank next time I'm around a town. I'm just glad that he's smart enough to actually be playing a druid, and that he's at a level where he can join us in group. I think that's awesome. Yeah. Now, did you look up that guy? Uh, I, I think you did, AC. The guy you were wanting to give a shout out to. Uh, I did, and I told you that guy's last time, and I don't remember what it was. So I'd have to look it up again real quick. <laughs> Neither do I. I'm, we're always, sorry, guys. That's always has to put me on the spot. Like he just, he just loves doing that. He's like, oh, okay. Uh, dude, I know really, you're not ready like, for it. So uh, it's uh, it's Phantom uh, Magoria NL. Phantasmagoria. He's, yeah, Phantasmagoria, and he's he's oh. the one who actually gave me the heads up that somebody else was uploading my videos. So I, I definitely want to give him a huge shout out. Uh, if you guys ever see that, if you ever, ever see somebody uploading another YouTuber's videos, uh, let them know. They have to contact YouTube or you guys can do it for them. Uh, either way, you, you don't want people pirating other people's uh, channels if you want them to continue. You know, if, like, if they're not able to make a living off of that and that's what they've dedicated themselves to do, uh, you know, they'll stop doing it and then you'll lose that YouTuber. So that might be a good or a bad thing depending on how you look at it and whether you like that YouTuber or not. But I also wanted to give him uh, another shout out uh, that was be uh, Chupacabra here because he gave me this item right here, this uh, autumn, this uh, fur cap basically, which is a magic item slot head. AC is 3, Dexterity 3, Wisdom is 6, Agility 2, and 7 hit points plus a uh, resisted cold plus 4. So that's pretty nice. That's that's really really uh, a pretty big improvement based on what I had before. And w what do you guys think? Do you guys uh, notice anything different so far, other than the fact that uh, my character looks different? Uh, I haven't noticed anything. What? Um, what you mean? Uh, are you? I don't even see what was it. What was it that they, that he gave you? Did you link it? No, I didn't link it. It was a hat. So the guy's not wearing one anymore. It's it's like a see through. Doesn't have a uh, texture to it, unlike oh, no, some of the I other hats. I haven't looked at you. I try not to look at. Um, um, it's because I'm too high beautiful. Elves, I'm high too beautiful. Because they, yeah, because they offend me. <laughs> he's he's afraid he's gonna fall in love, guys. My guy is so sexy. He's just, he's just beautiful. You can't help but look at the guy and be like, oh my god, like Fabio, man. Uh, pasty and pale. You look like a you look like a blonde Pee Wee Herman. Actually, he, he looks like he's doing the comb forward deal to cover the high forehead. <laughs> they're, they're just oh, jealous, guys. They're, they're just jealous because we got the looks and they don't. Yeah, I so mean, seriously, who jealous. wants to look like a barbarian? You know, he's big, he's tall, he's stupid. He got, he got no brains on the inside. His wisdom and his intelligence are like 30. Like, they are so low. He's he's lucky if he cannot trip over his own feet as he runs down the hallway. So yeah, Ooh, hey, <laughs> whatever. Uh, Thum is much better looking than you could ever be, my friend. <laughs> there might be some ups there for you. Uh, it's funny because I think the same way about all my characters. I think they all look, look cool. Pay uh, attention. What, what's look, up? Those might be gloves for you. For me? Yeah, the split how how high gloves. Ooh, They're two wisdom. Four AC, three Dex, and two wisdom. Let me look at that real quick, actually. Maybe not. Uh, no, I got four wisdom on the ones I have right now, but okay. it's nice. That's definitely nice. I, if nobody else wants it, I would say pick that stuff up, and we'll give it away during that uh, that holiday event that we're going to be doing here. Well, dude, I could do that again, man. Your skeleton was flipping out, dude. What'd you do to him just then? <laughs> uh, he was like, God, party time!" <laughs> I did intensify death. Uh, you know what I need? I need an invisibility spell, man, so I can go look at that bridge. I want to see what's going on. I want to see where it's at, dude. 
I want to see it so I can pull around it. But I guess you can't, man. I guess it's just death, dude. Well, no, there definitely has to be a way around that. And for those of you who, uh, you know, are just coming to the the episode, obviously you didn't get to see what happened on the the uh, in between. You know, basically what we did was we moved forward a little bit. We moved forward about a hundred yards uh, in the direction uh, <laughs> away from the entrance. And you want to tell them what happened? Well, apparently there's a bridge above the room right here. Uh, I'll show you guys right here with the double room. Uh, there's a bridge, and I haven't. I don't think I've ever been in Split Paul. I know I've killed Teshmal Knolls up top out in SK, but I don't think I've ever ever been down here. But anyway, if you open this door, guys, apparently there's a bridge up there, and there's a mob that roams who has a pet. And if he aggro's you, he brings like 40 or 50 Knolls at least. And they all come down here and they kill you. So I didn't know that. I didn't know that there was a bridge above that room. Uh, so, you know, we got killed twice. And... I was one blue away from de-leveling. Now, now I have two blues, so much better place. But, yeah, we, we died twice, and I lost a crap ton of experience. So I'm a little butthurt right now, guys, a little butthurt. The bridge is about 10 feet in and about 5 feet above the door. But, yeah, we got, man, it had to have been like 60 mobs. I mean, literally every mob in the zone beyond that door came with us and yeah, it was nasty it was nasty and we did it twice we did it twice because uh i actually opened the doors and i pulled a guy who i was right inside the room and i thought the problem see there's another door on the other side of that room and it's a good ways away from the double doors so i thought i could safely pull that guy without uh you know that happening again and it was not to be so but you also got to remember when we were fighting that how long do you think we were fighting those mobs before the other one showed up. It was a good bit, right? Almost uh, like a minute and a half, right? Yeah, I mean, there was a pause. There was a pause there. You're right. I mean, I don't I don't know if it uh, – I don't know, man. We, we had that guy down to, I think, 60 or 70% of his life. So we had 30 or 40% of his life uh, taken away from him. And then they all came in and was like, oh, we're going to save you, mate. Oh, and definitely. They yeah, they, they uh, came to sorry. his rescue. Yeah. So many, so many when it we came true here, that entire hallway that you see right before me, guys, completely filled. You couldn't even make out any names. They were so jumbled up in there on top of each other. Yeah, so. it was nasty, man. It was nasty. I feel bad, but I didn't know any better, guys. I, I mean, that's my only excuse is I didn't know any better. And first of all, uh, we didn't, I mean, none of us knew, I guess, because we all ran into that room. We were going to clear it. We were going to camp in there for a minute, take a take a rest and, uh, you know, just clear it out. And then we're going to move to the rest. <laughs> To the next room and apparently that's that's a bad idea guys it's just a bad idea who pulled that train earlier was it thum well uh yeah <laughs> come to the doors okay so we got to move up a little bit oh no this is gonna end badly guys it's gonna end badly. <laughs> let's see what i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and buff him up just in case things decide to go wrong but i i don't really think no. it's gonna matter uh, with the amount of numbers uh, that that come through that door when things go badly, it's just gonna. Okay, there's down. the bridge. If you even look up a little bit, guys, there's the freaking bridge. It's right there. See it? My God, I didn't even see it because of the way I had my mouse, the way I had my vision. And there's so. a roamer that walks over that. If you pull the guys by the door, and he's walking on that bridge. He'll run down and go all the way to the back side of the zone and then back through these doors and aggro everything in his way. There you yeah, go. Yeah, that's crazy. So and that's the guy the that I oh, pulled, we got one, guys. We got one here. Oh, no, no, it's okay. just his pet. It's just his pet. Never mind. Yeah, it's his pet. So you just have to make sure that Romer's not there and you're able to pull to your heart's content? <laughs> yeah. Well, then there you go. I told you there was a trick to it, man. I told you you had, yeah. to, you had to learn I mean, the yeah, room. I mean, I can't believe, I can't believe that I didn't... You know, I didn't see that bridge. Look how obvious that is, guys. Look how obvious that there. There's the Roma right there, too. Yeah, but don't beat yourself up, man, because it's sometimes the easiest things that we overlook, and you know, you gotta learn the areas as you go. It's into just them. a matter. It's just a matter of how I had my mouse. It's a matter of how I had my vision. I mean, I'm looking more down at the floor instead of if I would have had my mouse, if I'd had my vision up just a little bit, then I would have been able to see that bridge, and none of that would have happened. Right, but so, I mean, how many people well, actually look up? You know, very rarely. <laughs> Very rarely. Uh, well, you know, yeah, pullers, pullers are supposed to look all around, eh, man. They're supposed to check for stuff like that. So they are, but I agree with you. you got to be looking at the ground a little bit more often because that's where the oh. traps are. You're looking for discolorization in the flooring so you don't fall through. You're looking for stains of red so you know to kind of avoid those spots 
there might be a, a spike trap or something underneath you. So I, I do understand. I just that. I look at the floor because that's where you find the quarters. Yeah. <laughs> so are we? Are are you going to try to pull that? No, I'm not going to pull it. He's not going to pull it either because he knows that it's an extremely bad spot. Uh, I mean, he's two levels uh, higher than me. He's level 30. I'm level 28. And if he's got the sense not to pull it, guys, then I'm going to be respectful. And um, I think maybe I might try to convince my group to move to uh, the two guys to move to upper guck in, in the next couple <laughs> couple of videos. Because, uh, I mean, if you can't pull that room, what's the point? I mean, if we can't go past it, I'm sure we can. Well, All that's what he's saying right now is we're kind of, you know, there's too many people here. Although... Having that safety net is always a good thing, so I think they're perfectly fine with it. But I know Songmaster is going to leave here pretty soon. He's just on yeah, for a little so, short while. Yeah, so there's no point yeah. in us even going in there uh, because so we might get the. Uh, so so yeah, I mean uh, the three of us could probably go to um, to Upper Guck and and have a good time. See, there he goes right uh, there. So. He's leaving, and Chupa is going to be leaving here pretty soon as well. So we're, it's just going to be the the four of us, and I think that's going to slow it down a little bit more. And make it uh, a lot better. You know, I think the Enchanter can do most of this by himself. But even with that said, I think he has admitted that he likes having that, that safety net of other people here with him. Yeah. Well, you know, I can try and pull that room. I'm not afraid to pull that room, guys. It's just that uh, I'm afraid of deleveling. I'm definitely afraid of that. Well, speaking so, of that, I'm going to move back to the safe room. Yeah, let's move back. Yeah, you guys, move back to the safe room. I can definitely, and I'll just pull what we have available. I mean, I don't mind. I don't. I mean, it's just uh, the only one I'm worried about is Mega Mate, who uh, is uh, you know he's freaking level thirty, dude. So well, if he if you want to if you want to talk to him and and find out if he thinks it's a good idea to actually pull that room, uh, I would say go for it. I just if he doesn't want you to do it as the Enchanter because he's already died, you know, once or twice, however many times he's died. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it anymore. I really don't. I mean, <laughs> you're the puller. Yeah, I know. Even the even with the risk of you know, if that's if that's gonna happen again, no, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait to pull that room until I have a couple of yellows and can afford another hit because, uh, you know, we've two uh, two times we're two and zero, oh. we're zero oh and two or whatever. So, zero oh and two. Yeah, yeah. we're zero oh and two. Yeah, so with that room so <laughs> I'll just pull from in here. It might be a little bit slower going, but the experience in here, guys. I don't know if you've if you've noticed, but it's it's not bad, man. It's I mean, a dungeon. It's a, yeah, so it's, we're doing all right. So yeah, isn't it uh, like two hundred and thirty percent XP bonus here, or something like that? It's something, pretty nice. Something nuts, yeah, something crazy. Because I lost about a bubble there out of those two deaths, and pretty much all of it's back, other than I would say maybe about like fifteen percent of that bubble maybe isn't back hey, yet. Don't. So that's pretty Yo. quick. Loot that split. Oh, hold on, guys, hold on. I may have done a bad pull. Oh, there we go. Was it two, three? That's three? two. Two. No, we got. Two. Oh, he's got the his. Uh, yeah. yeah, the pet. Well, just watch out, man. I mean, that one came from really next to the door, so. Oh, did it really? Yeah. Dude. That's well, what I'm worried about. If you see it coming, let me know, and I'll, I'll definitely go for a run. Yeah, yeah. I don't blame <laughs> you at all, dude. I, I've always been in the back, guys. Every single time this has come, I've been way, way in the back where I need to be. <laughs> and there's like 60 dudes right in front of me that I have to run past to be able to try to zone it. And I'm overweight. This time I actually have Spirit of the Wolf on, so I didn't want to waste it. I wanted to uh, to avoid getting killed because if I can avoid getting killed, uh, then I won't have to uh, let these people wait so long before I can uh, revive them. Oh, there you go. You got Glimpse. Ah, because that's why you wanted them to loot it. Yep. You can use that on the, uh, the corpse over there. Maybe go sneaking into that room. Now, be very careful with that. Is that the one where it makes you... Uh... Ooh. This guy got no, that's the, the eye of Zim or something like that. That creates that little eye that you can move right, around. Zom. Yeah, Zom. There you go. Oh, is he is he heading out? Yes. Yeah, yeah, he's gone. Well, Chupa, thanks for coming out, man. We definitely appreciate it. We love the gifts. Yeah, dude. Uh, but definitely. we just liked having you here. We like, uh, you know, grouping with you. And you yeah, did you a fantastic job. Exactly like AC saying, you guys don't have to bring us anything. Just send us a tell, man. Let us know that you enjoy the videos. That's enough for us. Of course, if you want to bring us stuff, guys, uh, we're more than you know. We welcome that. We we always welcome a chance to to be stronger, be more powerful, because uh, I think that makes better videos. But it's guys, it's not a necessity in in the slightest, guys. Yeah. We, he, he was just I, letting us know that he had those on a 
an alt, and they were just kind of going to waste. So yeah, he says he's got a bunch of stuff in the bank and stuff like that. And we appreciate it, Chupa. We really do, man. So, uh, but you coming out and hanging out with us and being part of the team, that was uh, even cooler than if you would have, you know, given me a super badass sword, dude. I mean, really. Uh, having you here and hanging out with you, dude, that was awesome, dude. I don't know, really, Ben? Like, if he gave you a sword that was, like, on fire and it was shooting, like, lasers <laughs> and stuff out of it? I'd rather have a friend, man. A digital <laughs> sword. I agree. A, a digital sword will, uh, you know, it won't be with me. Uh, a friend might be until I die. So the digital sword, eventually I might, you know, take a break from... Um, P99, Perish what? the Thought. What? Uh, perish the Thought. What? <laughs> but, you know, I mean, I did before. I played it for four years straight. Got a little... But the way we're playing, guys, we're only playing like twice a week. So hopefully that won't happen anytime soon. We are now. We did have a little marathon session there for about two weeks where we played pretty much every day. Yeah, yeah. For like back. seven or eight hours. Like, it was pretty intense. And that's why I have that, that buffer zone of videos that you guys are watching uh, of like two months so yeah we did a lot of playing there well, and that's why we, we were trying to get up to what was it like level 35 yeah I'm going to interrupt here real quick uh, Chupa wanted everybody to know thanks for having him and everything and the only thing I demand from anybody that wants to group with us is show the gnome love no 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 that's not a requirement at all guys I mean seriously yes, <laughs> if uh, you so want to fit in guys uh, making fun of the gnome is <laughs> And also, guys, I leave my tail window kind of closed during these videos for the most part. So, uh, you know, I think he sent me a few messages in between the video or actually during the videos. And I didn't get them until in between. So I do apologize for that. In fact, he's probably saying bye right now. I just don't like showing that because it's personal messages people are sending. And, uh, you know, it's just I don't want to let everybody see that uh, in case somebody's saying something they don't want you know other people to know about it. now the reason i don't do it in the guild is one nobody's ever complained about showing the guild messages and two they're not really personal because everybody in the guild gets to see it you know it's not like one person sending a message to another person so i don't usually uh you know close that down but if the guild ever complains if any of you guys are watching and you don't want that up i will be more than happy to transfer that over to another window and then, you know, just minimize that during the videos. I hope that's okay. I hope you guys are fine with that. But uh, just let us know if you're not. Uh, definitely uh, willing to uh, to change it. Yeah, he hits hard. And then he again, the, the you know, his pet. Because oh, he yeah, has two yeah, weapons. He and he's an enchanter. You know, like, you're, you're going to get hit. <laughs> you tweaked him out well, but I want to actually fight him, dude. Oh, No. No, no, no. I, I think we, I think we should pull a uh, uh, super bits and Bob and, and leave the guy here for like the next guy who shows up and tries to solo. overlook my pet. Oh, uh, that's actually a good right. idea. I'm, I'm looking at your pet right now, man. He's a, he has a little dagger in his hand. Anyway, guys, we want to say thanks for watching. It's hamburgers and pickles time, and we will catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe. <laughs>